My friend just texted me, said I look good. Asked if I napped. I did not. I'm just giving her. I don't need a pregame nap. Is the lightning clear? And again, I got to tell you, the abs don't look terribly dangerous right now. A few moments later. Owen Byram and Devon Taves out there. Oh, did you get? He scores! Like lightning! The choo-choo train all stops to the back of the net again. He's always had the underlying numbers. You know, responsible defensive player. Who cares, man? Bury it. Here come the abs. They got numbers. Josh Manson. The deadline. This is what you get a player like that for, for moments like this. Two. Nothing. Colorado. His third career playoff goal. Not a bad time to get it. And the score in this game is what Colorado hopes this series is at for the end of the night. They lose the zone. Cavs top line breaks it out. Oh, Nathan McKinnon with the spin. If that went in, would have been spectacular. I don't know if it's possible to win the Stanley Cup in two games, in. but they should just call it. Can play a different velocity as well. Burakovsky. And the Abs! Oh, they score! You've got to be kidding! The Abs! Completely dominant! To start game two! Not even 14 minutes in! And the Abs! Once again, team, if you get have more line, goals easily, than the Lightning have shot. Andre Burakovsky scores for the second back, straight game. This looks like something else. Like, again, the abs. It's a miracle they're not up by more. It's not even like Vasilevsky's. What's holding him in it? Oh, my goodness. Valerie to shoot it again. No Stradangle or what? This guy can't stop scoring. All stops to the back of the net again. That's the man I wanted to see. His, his second of the game. Another four nothing. So Colorado less than five minutes the into the second. Tampa turns it over behind their own net, passing in front. In the high slot. And that's Andre Pallant, man. That's Andre Pallant. To Victor Hedman, the the attention to detail is not there, man. It's not there. The skill, the speed, the precision, the relentless work ethic and attention to detail that has gotten Tampa to their third straight Stanley Cup final is not there. It's almost five right there. Oh, Tampa almost getting picked off. No speed. Colorado relentless. Relentless. They're offside. Like, awful. Awful, awful. That's 42 seconds just flush. Flush right down the toilet. We haven't seen a team do this to Tampa since 2019. It was a different world. When your confidence is truly high, your team's a different fine. world. It's so easy to make plays. You got energy, you've got emotion, and now you gotta try to create some and you got a penalty killing group that's not really letting up Abs. pressure in the neutral zone. Collect Another the puck off the face off. Get it deep. This thing's gonna be half over before you know it. That's an icing call against this. Icing on the power play. Who are these guys? I think the Habs might have had too many men for a moment there. McKinnon brings it in on, on his own. In! Oh my goodness! What a stop by Vasilevsky! Wow! What a play from McKinnon. Nachushkin going for the hat trick, and that is a spectacular. Spectacular save from Andre Vasilevsky. Are you joking? Change for them. Manson puts it on rebound in front. Darren Helm couldn't find the puck. 
Nick Paul. One of the few lightning players who I think has looked pretty good in this one. Dumps it into the corner. Been feisty. Every shift a turnover. Ross Colton to no one, unfortunately, for them. Darren Helm breaks in. Eels shoot and score! The 35 year old who made his NHL debut winning a Stanley Cup in 2008 with the Detroit Red Wings makes it 5 0 for Colorado here in 2022. His 13th career playoff goal. Brings the Avs that much closer to going up two games to none. Vasilevsky can't believe it after the glove save he just made on the Chushkin. Wondering how didn't I stop that? He doesn't have the answer. I don't have the answer. But it's starting to look like the Avs might have the answer for the Lightning. They're averaging six a period. They're not going to win anything like that. Kucherov with it. Down low for Palat. Wham! Stamkos wanted that. Got to think it's going to be shoot first mentality here. Oh! Cleared off the line! Oh, kill McCarr. Barely getting to that puck in time. And then he rushes it out. It's a two on one. With Cogliano. Shoots and scores! Are you kidding me? What a boss! His dad does an interview! Has time to like high five all his friends! Watches his son score on a two-on-one for a six-nothing lead. Watch this. Watch the car clear. There's that Tampa chance. He has the poise to. Well, okay, he fanned on it at first, but we'll forget about that. He breaks it out. Does not think about passing it for even a second. Let's not. Let's not pretend. Forget about the pass. Snipes it. Where he's been that's, a, that's a terrifying human being. McKinnon, dazzling. Drops it off. Gets it back. McCart, the top unit's been out there the whole time. McCarr scores! <laughs> he doesn't even care! He doesn't even care! Yeah, he does! Round Papa! There's your Father's Day gift there, bud. 7 nothing. Colorado, Chris, the playoffs are all about trying and to take over away half a period to play to win. And this is one of those in game moments. two. One of those games. I cannot believe it. it. Uh, we have a request. No. Uh, Producer Drew has requested... that I sing all the small things. And I know the only reason he's requesting this is because he's at a wedding right now. Presumably, it's almost 11 o'clock. I was about to say half in the bag, but and he's a dad now. Okay, he's at a wedding. It's almost 11 o'clock. He's a dad now. No, he's, he's tuned. So I'm going to do my best. I'm not going to sing it. I'm not going to put anyone through that. But I am going to recite the lyrics the way I imagine Ron McLean would. All the small things, true care, truth brings. I'll take one lift, your ride, best trip. Always, I know, you'll be at my show, Hometown Hockey, with co-host Tara Sloan. Watching, waiting, commiserating. Say it ain't so, I will not go. Turn the lights off, carry me home. Na 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 na. <laughs> Sorry, I'm just imagining Ron with that part. Ah. Uh, man, Drew, you're a silly goose. 
But Cogliano rejoining the Avs. He was a factor immediately. Nazem Kadri potentially joining the Avs. Colorado up 2-0. Two games away from the Stanley Cup. Is looking like the best team the Lightning have faced over this now two and a half year reign. And I'm not going to lie, I don't know how Tampa gets back in this thing. But if they're going to, it's got to start at home. This building is rocking. And the way Colorado is playing, this might be the last game they play here this season. Never thought I'd say that of a team playing Tampa. Never, ever, ever. 7-0. Absolutely astounding. What a game from Colorado. The most dominant game I've seen against the Tampa Bay Lightning over the last few years. One of the most dominant Stanley Cup final games I've seen over the last few years. When was the last time you saw someone lose 7 nothing in the Stanley Cup final? I guess we'd be going back to at least 1996 when the Avs beat the Panthers 8-1. I can't think of another time, man. Watch the Stanley Cup playoffs with Steve Dangle. That's it. <laughs> Holy cow. Holy cow. I'm going to wrap it up here. We'll save this for Monday. If the Avs have any goals left for Monday. 